in high frequencies some of the materials like silicon gold and other noble metals have dispersive properties with frequency therefore we should define them in hfss for this purpose in the first step we should extract the properties of the purpose material from a reliable reference i usually use this site in this site in this part you can select the material and a reference such as the book or other references Then, its properties such as refractive index of this material will be shown here. From refractive index, you should compute the real part of epsilon r and the loss tangent, and save them as a tab-separated file. To save this file, you can use this command in MATLAB. Then, to define the material in HFSS, you should select dataset from project tab and by pressing import option the epsilon r and the loss tangent can be imported into the software Press down to close this page. By double click on the sphere in project tree, this page will be opened. Select material tab, then select edit. No, from this section, select set frequency dependency. If we have debate or other models of this purpose material, we could enter them here. Since we have epsilon r and loss tangent, we select the last option, which is interfrequency dependent data. Here, we can enter any properties which is variable with frequency. I have real part of epsilon r and loss tangent. So I enter them and then to close this page, press OK. Additionally, we can change the name of the material from this section. And by pressing OK, the definition of the material will be finished. You see, it is added here. I hope you to like this video. Please like this video and subscribe to this channel to support me. Thank you.